let me just say this movie is awesome, but my kid is driving me nuts. I was talking to the vlog. She driving me crazy. I'm trying to watch the movie. Yeah. Early. I was expecting this lot to be wrapped around the building. Yeah, because everybody's going to see it. And they say the movie theater is packed. Which is good because there's always a job. This movie is awesome, but my kid is driving me nuts. I was talking to the vlog. She's driving me crazy. I'm trying to watch the movie. Yeah. Hello, 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 and welcome to the Working Mom Vlogs. It's Nikki. I'm your girl. No, start over. Hello, 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 and welcome to the Working Mom Vlogs. My name is Nikki, and I'm back. So. Today, we're gonna do something just a little bit different for you guys. Normally, you catch me doing some vlogs, you know, shop with me, spending time with my family. What we're gonna do, we're gonna give you a little bit of that, plus some. So, last night, me and my family spent some time at the movies together, so you will get a vlog. However, that movie we went to see, is definitely, definitely needed to be reviewed. So. Here you are. Today I'm doing a review on the movie Bad Boys 3. It's a trilogy. So that movie was hands down the best Bad Boys to date. Yes, I said it. I said it. I, I said it. Best movie to date. So if you haven't seen that movie, I'm gonna give you a few minutes to go ahead and uh, click the off button. Just go about your way. You don't wanna listen to this. However, if you have seen that movie, park a seat, take a seat, so we can discuss it. I'm waiting, waiting, waiting for the people who haven't seen it yet. Okay, okay. So, I'm gonna start with saying the way that they portrayed Marcus. Martin was hilarious, but it goes so good with the whole plot and everything. I think that Martin's character, Marcus, um, was that we're getting old so we need to slow down and I'm trying to teach my homeboy that uh, you need to do something with yourself. Get your life together. Get you a woman. Get some kids. Settle down. Lo and behold. <laughs> so um, the whole movie starts out with Marcus and Mike. Um, Marcus is basically trying to live his best life with his family and the in intro to the movie of you thinking they're in this outrageous police chase is crazy and it's them being escorted to um, Marcus's grandbaby. So the best funniest thing about all of that was that the guy from, is it Bad Boys 2 I think, that was dating his daughter is still in the movie. So that's the, the most cutest, funniest thing that they could have added in there. It makes you think like, dang, they pulled old boy back. You know, the boy that was scared and, and, and terrified of Marcus and Mike, Mike Larry. <laughs> so um, yeah, so I thought that that was, that was pretty cool. They brought that guy back um, and he's married to the daughter in the new trilogy. Uh, what else? Um, I'm not gonna go too much into detail, but if you saw it, you know what I'm talking about. Uh, the whole scene with the captain just just killed it for me. But I think it was needed in order to move the movie along. Also, um, so the young lady that is ahead of the special team that they are working with, 
I want to say, I was trying to explain to my husband, I think she was in the other movies, and I think she worked in, like, technology admin or something, and they used to go to her for, like, info. If I'm not mistaken, I, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to look that up, because I, I think I, think I want to say that she was in the other movies, but I'm not quite sure. If you know that, let me know. Tell me down below or something. What else? Um, so, uh, other favorite parts. Uh... When, uh, when, uh, when Marcus, like that hit, Martin Lawrence was like, he made the movie, like him wanting to be just this guy that stay, the stay at home granddad and take care of his grandbaby and just do nothing else just was hilarious because you could see he, you could see he, they, the way they portrayed him is he really has gotten old, but all in all, <laughs> he still got that bad boy for life, you know, soul, so, you know, he gonna ride or die for his homie, but he, he, he just, he, he, he went about that life. <laughs> um, what, else? what else? What else? What else was a good part? Um, I think, oh, I'll, I'll talk about this. I think that Will Smith is still, like, even in his prime, because I think, you know, he's, well, he's outside his prime. You can, you can see that he's gotten old, but at the same time, he still plays that character very well. Uh, what else? What else? Uh, the, the, we talked about the captain, we talked about the group of people that they worked with, we talked about, um, who else, um, the young lady from the group that they're working with, and, um, so anyway, the surprise ending. The surprise ending, um, I guess I won't tell that for those that watched it, you know what I'm talking about. Um, it leads you to believe that there's going to be another movie and that's what I'm excited about because I'm like, we waited 10 years for the first one I think. First one to the second one was about 10 years and this this time it's been about 3 to 5 years. I'm not really sure. 3 to 5 years. So um, it leads you to believe that there's going to be another one. And it kind of lets you see that um, Mike Larry has some uh, some responsibilities to take care of. <laughs> um, the the funniest part to this movie, I swear, is when they're riding in the minivan and the minivan was, was damaged in a crime scene. That is the most hilarious, like freaking, his wife go kill him. That's all he could think about. And it made you think about like as as a as a man when when men knew they've done something wrong or they messed up and they gotta go home to their wives, they're like, how bad you think she go be? <laughs> um and then the other part that was really funny to me was when they dropped that damn baby off, like that really make you think of a husband and wife, like real real life stuff. When they he dropped the grandbaby off to the wife and went and did some work, but she was at the spa. We'll check. I probably would. I would have strangled my husband. But <laughs> that to me, that probably was the funniest part. That to me, that I I literally cracked up this entire movie. So I'm I'm here to say that I give this movie a 20 out of 10. That's how good I think it was. Um, and I'm excited for them to you know bring a fourth one if at all possible. It is very hard to do three movies that are consistently good movies and every single movie that they've made for bad boys has been out the park but this has been the best so let me know if you agree comment down below Com comment down below let me know if you agree and uh, make sure you subscribe and thank you for watching work my walks Doodle.